Hi, this is Nicholas Bell with Ion Cinema, and welcome to our top 100 most anticipated international features of 2022. At number six on our list is Triangle of Sadness, directed by Ruben Ostlund, which is, of course, the sixth film directed by the Swedish auteur, uh, who has unveiled nearly all of his films at the Cannes Film Festival. Uh, in 2008, he went to Un Certain Regard with Involuntary. Uh, he returned to that sidebar in 2014 with Force Majeure, uh, which won the uh, grand prize in that sidebar. In 2011, Play uh, was part of the director's fortnight. And then, of course, uh, Mr. Oslin won the Palme d'Or in 2017 for The Square. So this is his follow-up to that, which uh, he's been working on almost uh, since 20, the end of 2017, early 2018. Uh, shot in Sweden and Greece. Uh, it is about an elite cruise uh, where a Marxist captain decides to punish uh, the crew members during a violent storm. There's uh, seasickness and food sickness and uh, also somewhere in there are plot details about a pair of models uh, at a crossroads in their career. Uh, a, a part of its large cast includes Woody Harrelson and Harris Dickinson. Uh, it was shot by Frederick Wenzel who uh, lends the last couple features The Square and Force Majeure uh, for Ostland. Uh, we anticipate that as per usual, he will show up again, this time competing a uh, second time for the Palme d'Or at the 2022 Cannes Film Festival. Thank you. Hey, this is Eric from IonCinema.com. If you want to support us, subscribe below. For more reviews, interviews, film festival coverage from Sundance, Cannes, Toronto, you want to check out these guys on this side.